hello babes welcome back to the channel who's messaging me um we're gonna be doing some shopping today some more decor shopping like i said i'm gonna switch up my bathroom a little bit i have to return some things at home since um i'll probably grab a drink as well when i'm out and maybe i'll find a kitchen kind of carpet thing by my sink um and what else oh yes the bathroom faucet i need to get a um bathroom faucet i kind of know which one i want from lowe's so we're gonna be going to lowe's and then probably a home sense as well and see what they kind of have there if you're new to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button just click it and click the bell so you guys get notified for all of my brand new videos and follow me on ig it is at step g macedo it's right here um yeah so we're gonna be doing some shopping i'm gonna bring you guys with me I'm really excited about the bathroom. I can't wait until it's like all done up. I'm still kind of confused about the shower bath area just because to be honest, I'm not like 100% in love with my tile and my dad tried to talk me out of it. He's like, that's a big job and blah, blah. And I'm just like, mm, don't try to talk me out of it. I like my tile in my shower bath and I'm just like debating like, do I even buy a door and spend that money and then you're not even happy like 100% with the tile? Or do I buy the door, wait, change the tile down the, down the line? But it's like, why? Like, But yeah, I'm going to think about it and see what I want. I think I definitely still want that bath door anyways because I don't even like when I'm filming in there and the background's like that shower curtain. I just don't like it. I'd rather it all glass. I did want the shampoo shelves like inside the wall but then that is a whole other thing so i'm kind of like do i change the tile and then while they're changing it see what's behind that wall see if it's possible if it's not possible and i don't like where it can go then i can just do the shelving kind of option i'm going to also be changing my kitchen faucet too so that everything is black and white in there because right now the only thing that's silver is the freaking faucet and it just doesn't look good yeah let's go shopping you guys i forgot my glasses in the car so i can't see <laughs> go see that one right there let me get a better view and it's like so me it's for my island because when i'm filming i don't have enough light with that one thing that i bought from ikea and honestly it just looks really like hella cheap so that's definitely more my styles it takes me a while to commit to stuff like this because i love to look at all my options i don't like to just choose like one that i see and i like it's actually they're 25 percent off so it's like 179 right now and i would get 25 percent off of it which is not bad for a fixture like that um, and I feel like I would get a lot more light if I film by my island when it's like super cloudy. The other thing, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's not symmetrical. Like I'm really big on symmetry. So this side is heavier than that side and that's just a part of the design. And I was looking at this carpet for my, this is how it looks, for my kitchen. I, it kind of looks like pinky here, but the thing is when you go home, it can change, right? So it can blend with my floor this is just for right now it's just to have something there i might end up just loving it but i don't think i want a full runner because i love seeing my floor come through um so i might pick this up and i'm going to show you guys what faucet i got for the bathroom oh they have the ones up here oh my god i was just looking at the bottom you guys the faucet i'm getting it's this one right here the guy has asked me twice now if i need help i'm like i'm good thanks the reason why I'm getting this one is because the spout is longer, this one's too short, and my hole is like really far back. So I don't want to get it too short and then, you know what I mean, the water flow. So I'm getting that one, and they're 20% off right now. Let's go see what else they have over. Oh, these are cute, but they're linen. I'm not a linen person. Ugh, it's rough. That one always looks at me weird. Every time I have my sunglasses on in the store, like, do you guys think I'm going to steal something or something? Look at these pillows. They're so nice. These are outdoor, by the way. But at first they kind of looked soft, but they're such like, oh, I love this color. That mirror is really cute over there too. $100, a little overpriced. Okay, let's go check over there. Having a craving and I haven't had Harvey's in like the longest time. There's like a pole there, so I'm trying to make sure, you know. Watch yourself. Why am I even applying lip gloss right now? I think I'm gonna find a home sense that we can go look around at. I'm vlogging on my phone right now, by the way, you guys. I feel like it's easier right now. Um, I'm gonna grab my food right now. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome, Mom. Yes. Wait until you guys see what I got. <laughs> got a poutine. If you guys don't know, poutine is a Canadian thing. Um, it's basically fries with beef gravy over top and cheese curds. Mm. It's my favorite, and right now is like my craving time. I this is when I like to get these things, you guys, like just to let you know. 
um, because I know it's gonna happen and again I just like to be balanced and have you know these types of things sometimes I'm not really big on this type of food anyways um, and then I got a crispy chicken sandwich this is also my go-to if you guys don't know I'm trying not to let this tip over and it's freaking hot you guys um, so I always get crispy chicken anywhere I go. I love chicken sandwiches and I did get an iced tea on this side Which I barely drink any when I get it um, But it's the only pop that I can actually drink and that I used to drink before when I drank pop But I just kind of sip on it here and there But I literally drink like this much you guys out of the cup like I don't finish it and I also have some water with me There's some cheese stuck in my permanent retainer I have a permanent retainer if you guys didn't know top and bottom because I had braces for like three years. And I didn't get the carpet because the more I looked at it, I was like, this looks pinky and I know I'm going to get home and it's going to be too pinky. But we got here to HomeSense and finished my meal because I'm not used to consuming that many calories in like one sitting. So I'm not surprised about that. First, I'm going to get my mask. I swear I'm going to start doing my makeup from like here up. I like to bring my garbage out of my car because I cannot stand. I don't know if you guys are like that, but I can't stand when my car has garbage. Like everything has to go. You know like the front area where they have all the glass and stuff? I always like ignore this part and walk past it. I don't know what it is. It's just, I'm just not into them. Okay, so far I've walked in like four or five aisles and nothing. <laughs> and this one is a lot more empty. Look at this, you guys. Empty, empty, empty. This one is really pretty. If I was looking for like a like a rectangle black mirror because it's like very simple very minimalistic $39.99 for that it's really pretty but I can't think of a place where I would want it but I only see one I found both you guys but I don't really need pillows but these are so like me so my style love the color it's like a pale stone color when you're trying to come up with an excuse to buy them I kind of wanted to get rid of the feather ones on my bed I can always try them and see what I think, but they're so pretty and I love this fabric. It's chenille, by the way. That's what this fabric is called. I actually don't burn a lot of candles now unless they're like absolutely natural, like pure soy. This is a cute face. We got home, but my drink was just a little bit too, um, too much matcha. I asked for like just two extra scoops, but I guess they put a lot more. I feel like lately I've been liking it with a little bit less, so maybe I'll just ask for one. But sometimes when you do, they make it so... Like, there's a few times where I get it and it's literally, literally the color of soy milk with a little bit of like a, a green tint. Like lighter than this foam at the top. So our drink is ready. Let's go through what we bought. It's been so humid here. It does sound like complaining and then when, you know, winter comes, we're always like, oh my god, it's so cold. But the thing is, like... We're, we're basically just like New York, right? We get a lot of cold and then when it gets too, too hot, we're just like, oh my God, it's too hot because we get so used to most of our year not being warm. I'm gonna say fun facts, but it's not really fun. Um, don't get matcha on your clothes. I like basically ruined a pair of my misguided jeans onto my light jeans and I was like washed it I scrubbed it with oxyclean. I did everything like everything you could possibly imagine. So guess what I did? I did a DIY That's right. You turn hard times into good times. You know what I'm saying? So just grabbed the scissors I chopped a little hole right there and then I chopped one on the other side and now The ripped jeans Watch yourself. I made a little bathroom makeover checklist over here so let's check that some let's check some things off ah the match is kicking in so i put cab handles short form for cabinet handles watch so so we got that today and the cabinet handles are in so my kitchen as you guys can see it's like this style see the difference the kitchen is a different space and i don't really want to connect the spaces like that like, all of my handles on my doors are round handles they're not square like even the back uh, plate is round the other thing with these ones compared to these ones is that these are longer so and then you also see this on the side so each and every one you see all this and there's like 20 cabinets here that have to have this so i'm like that's just a lot going on and i wanted it to be very simple and very clean because my bathroom is two cabinet doors, I'm okay with this. Plus, I feel like it suits my hardware that I got, my faucet, sorry. 
Next thing on the list was faucet. We got that done. Watch yourself. That was a mouthful. Okay. I can easily install this today, but honestly, I want to do like a whole makeover for you guys and show you what the bathroom looks like now, what it looks like after. And again, these are all really affordable ways to like make it look like you did a big rental, but you did not. Um, the biggest change that I'd be doing would be to change the tile. That's like the biggest thing. Next, we got our bathroom fuzzy. I'm so excited about this. Like, don't ask me why I get excited about bathroom faucets, but I do. And I'm going to get just as excited as my kitchen one. But I'm looking on Amazon because they have a few different ones. And don't be scared to get, like, the no-name brand ones or the not-so-popular ones because a lot of times when you're buying something, you are paying for the name. A lot of times. Moen, this is a big name you're paying for. And this one, luckily, I don't know if it's an older style. I don't care. It's the style I'm looking for. Um, but still, it was $1.94 and I didn't get that 25% off. Where is this beauty? Where is she? She's right here, y'all. Okay, I don't want to mess this up. But look, you guys, it looks so gorgeous. It has that lever at the top. It basically matches um, my door handles because everything is like kind of round. Comment down below if you guys like seeing these decor kind of inspo videos. So it matches. Everything is nice and round, you know? the vibe i want to put you on a show that you have to watch i've been sharing it like non-stop for like the past two days on my ig story down to earth it's with zach efron and i keep forgetting the other guy's name on netflix you guys have to watch it i don't know i'm very into those things so it's all about like discovering different parts of the world so each and every episode is different they go to peru they go to iceland they go to puerto rico they go to they go to um london they go to some other places and it's all about like how those countries are like working on sustainability like it's insane you guys there's some food in there um you see the culture like, i think i have two episodes left and i'm gonna be watching it after i'm done with you guys so i got this little organizer because we had to return that big one that i got like i don't know what i thought like what i was thinking though you guys is i'm doing this completely backwards before i go out and looking for these things i need to plan what i need remember that little container that i got from the bath section that was in my last vlog if y'all missed that vlog there's more decor in there so go check it out watch yourself this is from that matching set you guys the one with the rib detail so i got this little soap dish and you might be asking yourself how did you get a soap dish that you don't use soap like that well this is what i'm gonna do a rubber pad like i use on my face to like exfoliate my makeup off i love those things and it has like the um the suction cup at the back I thought about putting it inside of here instead i got two of these they're different but they're from the same collection so i got this one this style where it's just the like hollow and that's it and this one's hollow too but it has the divider so this would be for like toothbrush and uh the toothpaste yeah and then these two pillows so thank god sometimes when i buy this color you guys i get home and it's like gray and i'm like Ugh. it happened to me twice with two bathroom mats that i got these are so gorgeous this is the color i wanted to do my couch like when i first was like designing it we're gonna try them on my bed and see how they look obviously i'm gonna show y'all you watch this though are y'all noticing like people are acting like a little bit crazy right now yeah okay so here's the difference you guys can see oh by the way since the last video i moved fiona over there and i got rid of that chair because i'm sorry i've been dying to get rid of that chair for a while now i'm still liking this carpet don't get me wrong but i'm also considering finding one that goes beneath all the way around my bed because i do feel like it makes the bedroom look a lot more rich and it doesn't cost that much you guys can see this is a little bit more of like a sandy whereas this one's more cream you always get a zipper because you will always have the inserts at home from your other pillows that you're replacing so if you have the zipper you just switch them out and all you have to do is just fold now the casings around the pillows instead of storing the pillow plus the casing on the inside imagine storing if you're like me and you love different pillows imagine storing pillows instead of storing just the casing so that's a really big tip if you guys didn't know that but i'm pretty sure a lot of you guys do i wanted to show you guys the difference this is my pillow from my sofa you see how like you can't really mold it this is the like polyfill whereas this you can mold it you see that where it looks like really plushy really kind of expensive they look so cute you guys like it makes it look so much more rich i definitely prefer these over the fur ones and i think i'm gonna end up switching i don't know it's like the hardest finding the most 
perfect comforter I just went with this gridded one because I was just like honestly I need something lightweight for spring and summer you see that black thing over there the um, silk dispenser so that's actually from Ikea except I switched the top of it I did want to share it with you guys and I forgot in my last video so I switched the top with one that I already had the reason why I love it is because it's so like look at the side of it it's like so slim and minimalistic so it is from Ikea and then if you already have one that has a black top you can just switch it out or if you already have um, anything chrome in your place then it'll work because it comes with a chrome top but I think it was like six bucks or something so I wanted to show you guys what it would be like instead so this is a little bit longer so you see how it's the same I actually didn't know that but it's fine because it kind of like dresses it up a bit like it gives it a little bit more of a grander look instead of just the small one it's gonna be like this instead it's gonna look so nice what do you guys think so yeah so inside of here it's like all messed up you guys like i cannot wait oh yeah and then one side is gonna be like all my perfumes i get so many questions on my perfume collection okay so even though this is a mess it's not organized i'm going to tell you starting over here juliet has a gun this one's called mmm I'm not playing with you. It's called mm. And then this one over here is my, oh, this is my fave, 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 fave. It's my second bottle that I bought. Second or third. It smells so freaking good. It's very like, if you just want to know what I smell like, it's this. Okay, just smell this. Um, they have it at Shoppers Drug Mart. One of you guys shared it with me for my Canadian babes. But for you guys in the US, you'll be able to find this too. They sell it on Amazon, perfume like online stores. But I'll try to link that for you guys because I got it cheaper from a perfume shop online and it is legit because I like this is my second purchase from them super 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 particular about my perfumes um, and this one is just very very different this is like the sweetest I've ever gone with perfumes and this is just really I don't know it's it's not bizarre but it's just I don't know I think you have to smell it to be like Okay, this is different, but it smells so freaking good. I always feel like every girl should have like their cheap perfume. Something that they can just grab, they can like wear at the gym or something if you want to smell good. Get groceries or whatever. You don't want to wear something like this. Like why would you wear something expensive, right? They used to have a pink bottle that was also musk because they have like a collection. But I can't find the pink one and I believe the pink one ended up being my favorite. So this is very, very powdery. This one also has, has like a little slight powdery but has like that musk in it and it has something else I can't remember what it has um, and this perfume has only one ingredient in it I believe that's what I read about it so that is my little perfume collection that a lot of you keep asking about and I forget to show you guys but I will leave a link to all of these down below I'm gonna show you guys when the kitchen faucet gets changed and how everything kind of looks if you guys like seeing more decor videos let me know down below i'm gonna film the whole transformation of the bathroom for you guys which i'm really excited about it might not be today tomorrow next week but i'm going to film everything from top to bottom i'm gonna go relax i'm gonna watch those last two episodes again do not forget to watch that show because it's so 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 good it's called down to earth again um hopefully you guys enjoyed going shopping with me don't forget to subscribe and if you're new to my channel welcome hopefully you enjoyed i'm thinking of doing a giveaway really soon so so make sure y'all show some love because i'm watching you hello no yeah okay thanks bye hello yeah no they know to follow me on ig yeah they know okay thanks bye hit that bell so you guys get notified for all my new uploads i have so many more videos coming your way y'all thank you guys so much for watching and i will see all of my beautiful babes in my next video